uh, this is Muni Hussain from Wifix Pro. Uh, you already know. So uh, today I'm going to show you uh, how you can uh, edit and extract uh, Lenovo Lenovo BIOS. So let's see what we have here. You have Lenovo L440. This is our old backup and this is the file we have downloaded from uh, Lenovo website so you can see here uh, this is our uh, model L440 a laptop ThinkPad so here is our BIOS you can see this is and we have downloaded from here so you download from he, uh, here here uh, uh, this website Lenovo website and uh, let's see how we can extract this BIOS and we can use it. So first of all you download and you'll get this file like that. So what do we do? We'll just double click and we'll install. Here you see the, the destination uh, C drive plus and then uh, the, this file name so this one will extract uh, in this folder so here you, uh, you see that selection install thinkpad bios update utility now so we will un uh, untick this one and then finish because we are not going to install uh, this bios in this machine so let's see uh, Go our C drive and then you see the driver file and then flash. Here we got our uh, folder, the unpack folder. So in this folder we have our desired file. So we copy this one, we copy, then paste it here, no problem. Or uh, we can uh, paste here also. So it will be good to see. So this one we open our hex editor. We open. This is our hex editor. So here is our file, the uh, original. Uh, I mean the update file from uh, downloaded from the uh, manufacturer website. And here is our uh, backup, old backup. So we also open this and then we compare uh, this is our 8 MB file so all the way down so here we can see uh, this is our uh, last buy so from here we can copy, we copy like this this 4 bit uh, I mean this 5 bit see no problem so we copy and then we we'll look for this in our update file. So we we'll find this here. We we'll paste it. And here is text text string. So we we'll, uh, we'll select it as X text value. So we we'll click OK, and then we have found our desired place from where we can uh, copy. So. From here you can see the last part F4 FF. So we go here. You see F4 FF. So from here uh, we'll copy up. We'll go up and then from up. With my mistake. Let's go to there and then from here. We select all the way up then we copy we copy this selection and we'll open new one and we'll paste it here so we have pasted it <coughs> sorry now you can see here uh, here is our offset you know, uh, 4001 e8 so we'll uh, some 
some byte uh, the uh, header the header we uh, don't want so we'll delete that uh, that one so uh, let's go to select the block we'll delete delete some portion of this header so we'll select our length here so we'll just uh, select one e eight Eight. So we'll delete. We'll delete this portion. We no need. This is extra information. We no need this. So from here, we can take a look that we are in good position or not. here we can see a, our uh, 4 MB already this is uh, 4 after 5 uh, 0 so we are uh, in 4 MB position so uh, our original file is 8 MB 8 MB but here we have got uh, 4 MB from the updates so we need one, 4 more MB so uh, we can compare this this is uh, you can see that uh, 8 MB file here so we have got only uh, 4 MB here so we need uh, more 4 MB 4 MB more so uh, this 4 MB we can take from the uh, original uh, backup so we go up we go up and then from here we select 4 MB select our block 4 MB 4 1 2 3 4 5 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 and yes 5 0 so we click this one and then uh, from here you can copy 4 MB copy So uh, uh, we have copied from here, and then uh, the uh, this one is our bias region uh, from the uh, website update. So we'll uh, paste it here. So we'll paste here. Just paste insert. Yes. Now we are good to go let's compare the uh, files so what we uh, have done here let's revise this is our update and then from here we have copied 4 MB uh, 4 MB and then we have pasted here in, in new panel after that we have taken um, after that we have uh, we have uh, deduct the header which, was, which we don't want and then uh, after that we have copied 4 MB 4 MB from the old backup and then we have pasted it uh, from the beginning from the beginning so our BIOS region we have taken from here and then we uh, we have uh, copied here uh, I mean paste here and after that uh, we have uh, all the other region AV region and then GB region descriptor region we have copied from the old backup like before we have showed even uh, the Dell laptop all all this procedure are same so we have taken from there and then we copied in, in the new panel so we have our uh, 8 MB file here you can see 
this is our 8 MB total so we can uh, we are we are ready to use this file as a new backup new new bin we are ready so this file you, you can use with no worries because this is actually what I we wanted and then the manufacturer website we have taken so it will 100% work so I think you can understand if don't understand you can uh, uh, you can uh, write down to our forum or you can message uh, us uh, to, uh, via Skype so we can contact with you no problem we can answer your question I hope you guys are uh, you guys understand what I want to show you so hopefully you will be benefited from this uh, BIOS uh, how we can uh, edit and use your Lenovo BIOS hopefully uh, you'd love our uh, tutorial and don't forget to like and subscribe our channel and then also be member of our uh, this forum and we are uh, going to make some other uh, tutorial also um, how we repair uh, laptop motherboard so thank you for watching bye bye